Hey everyone, welcome to Theater, Cinema, and Film Production. We are so excited to get this new course into our FLVS full-time program this year. Me and the other teachers are super, super excited about it, and we are going to have a fantastic year. I just wanted to go over a few things to help get you started on your this exciting road to theater, cinema, and film production. Um, I wanted to go over a few navigation tools that will make your life in this course a lot easier. All right, so to start with, let's go ahead and add a side navigation bar. If you haven't already done so, go ahead and click underneath your name. Here's my name, Michelle Marbra. I'm going to click the arrow and I'm going to go to account preferences. Once at account prefer preferences, I'm going to choose side navigation. Yes, because currently it's not on. So we want to turn it on. So yes, and then save changes. Give it a couple of minutes, a couple of seconds. And here we have our side, side navigation. It makes viewing the course so much easier. Now, this is our announcement page. We have welcome to week one, and at the at the top of this, our announcement page each week, we will tell you what assignments are due by Friday. So please be sure that you're paying attention to this area at the very top of our announcement page. If you would like to download our pace chart, right here, it says click here for the pace chart for segment one. You can go ahead and click on that and that will take you to your segment one pace chart and you can download what assignments are due each week for the entire semester. Now if you scroll down a little bit further, we have our contact information. This is mine when we're available. If you want to call or text, here's my phone number. If you'd like to schedule an appointment with me, because usually that's a lot easier, um, that way we won't have to play phone tag, you can just click on the book now and it will take you to my virtual secretary and you can schedule an appointment that's, um, that's convenient for you. Okay. Also, I have my email address here as well. Now over here in the left hand, excuse me, in the right hand column, our live lessons are every Wednesday at 11 a.m. And right here, it says click here to join the live lesson. You don't have to download anything um, as long as you have Illuminate, you are set up. So go, you would just click right here and it will take you directly to our live lesson. I would definitely suggest logging in about 10 to 15 minutes early on the first session, um, which will be August 23rd. So next Wednesday will be our first session. I would again, check in early. So that way you're able to make sure that you do, you are able to access the live lesson, okay? And if you scroll down a little bit further, we have an academic integrity video. And if you're not sure when your live lessons are scheduled in your other courses, you can click right here on this little calendar and it will take you to our FLVS full-time live lesson calendar. And you're able to see when all of your courses live lessons are. All right, I know that was a lot of information, but we're gonna move on. So if you scroll to the top, now, how do you get to your assignments? Well, the first thing you need to do, just like any course, a course has books. So we don't have traditional textbooks because we're an online school. So you, to enable to get your books, you'll click on lessons, this lessons tab right here. And this will take you to our lessons, theater, cinema, and film production, getting started. Now, the easiest way to access each lesson is if you, right here, it says menu, link to menu, and you can click on getting started, and that will take you to the first one, and then you'll just click, and it actually shows you, it lets you know the title of the lesson, and it lets you know how long each lesson should be. So this one's 10 minutes, the next one's 10 minutes, and so on, and you can just go through it that way, and it'll... Um, then the next section, once you're finished with that, you will jump over to um, the next lesson and you will go through this one, 101, 102, 
excuse me, 1.01, 1.02, 1.03. 1 and it will also show you if there's an assignment to at the end of each lesson. Some of these assignments are really, some of these lessons are really pretty quick. Um, but, and the lessons will not be, excuse me, the assignments will not be due until the end of the lesson. So for example, 1.07, this assignment is worth, is 60 minutes long and it's worth 100 points. 1.08, it's a lab project, it's 90 minutes long and it's worth 90 points. So you're able to see how long each lesson is and how much they're worth. Now, once you finish your lesson, you will want to submit your assessment. And the way you can access your assessments is in the assessments tab, which is right here. You will click on assessments, are listed right here. And once you complete it, it will disappear from this list. Now, the way to submit an assignment is easy. You will just go ahead and click on your assignment, scroll down until you see where it says that you can add a file. Add file here. You'll click on that, you'll add your file You'll make sure you check submit for grading and then you will submit your assignment for grading. That's it. All right, so we looked at our lessons tab and our assessments tab. Those are the two main tabs that you will use the most. Um, you are also able to look at your grade book. We give you comments on everything that you turn in. So once you turn your assignments in and we have a chance to grade it, if you go to your grade book, you're able to see the assignments that were graded. I haven't done any work yet, so nothing's been graded, but this is where your grade book is, so you'd be able to see your score. And let's say you received a 70% out of 100 on this assignment. If you click on the assignment, you're able to view the comments that I've given you on the assignment and what you can do to resubmit your assignment for a higher grade because you can always resubmit assignments. All right, last thing I want to show you is email. We promise not to inundate you guys with emails too much. So when we email you, it's usually pretty important. So please make sure you're reading the emails that we send you. You Right here, this is your check email tab. So if you have a number, if yours is red and it has a number in it, it lets you know how many emails that you have. If it's three, four, make sure you're checking your emails. Please, please, please. All right. Well, those are, that's enough, I don't want to overwhelm you. Those are enough things to help get you started um, navigating through the course. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to email us or reach out to your teacher, okay? Again, lessons tab is like your textbook in, um, in brick and mortar. And then assignments, that's where you will be turning your work in. And the grade book is where you will see how you did. All right. Thanks so much. I look forward to working with you all. Have a great day.